Yo, what's up, everybody? Welcome to the stream. How you guys doing? You're now tuned in with HTG. <laughs> yeah, so I had to throw I had to throw the little tag in there, you know, because um, you know, I was like, man, I got this intro going on right. And, um, I never be, you know, like, unless I make an edited video, I can't really throw it in the live stream, right? So I was like, man, how am I going to do it? Because, to be honest, I feel like that's super epic. Like, that is like, you know, there's a lot of better YouTubers than me. You know, I'm, when I say YouTubers, I'm talking about, like, in the wolf, right? There's a lot of better wolf YouTubers than me, you know? They get way more views, way more likes, way more subscribers way more everything right but one thing that i got going for myself for sure for sure is i got the whole my intro you know now like here's the thing about intros guys you know if you guys are trying to be a youtuber or become a youtuber you know an intro is always cool because an, an intro always show professionalism you know it show but it shows you know it kind of makes people want to like okay let me check them out but at the same time you can't have the longest intro ever, right? It gotta be quick and simple, right? This isn't like a, uh, this isn't like a, you know, a TV series where like the intro gotta be like 30 seconds long. Like I see some of you guys have pretty long intros, you know, you guys, it's, they're nice intros, right? But you know, people are gonna be watching your videos every day or like if you want them to watch it every day, you don't wanna bore them with the intro, you know? Even when you watch Netflix or, you know, or Hulu or whatever you watch, you can actually skip. You can actually skip the intro. What's up, Aku? Welcome to the stream, man. How are you doing? So, yeah, guys. Uh, by the way, this is my current attack, my current health, my current CP. Right now, this is kind of where I'm at. Uh, yeah. By the way, guys, out here in Chicago, it's currently 9 a.m. in the morning. It's raining outside, but guess what? Today I'm off work. I don't have to work today, so it's a beautiful day for me. <laughs> As previously mentioned in the past, you know, any day I don't have to work is a wonderful day. Any day that I do have to work is still wonderful as well, because you know what? I love getting money. That's the facts. Uh, so before we get into, you know, uh, my weekly quests, which um, this is what I got going on right now, right? So obviously the bounty hasn't started yet, right? So I'm pro I'm gonna claim my daily quests because I can get my daily quests again to regenerate before the bounty starts. And but my weekly quests I've been holding off on. So I already got a few. As you guys can see, I got uh, this week's reward. It's 45 Moonstones. Last week's reward was 200 gems. So, that's cool. I mean, I, I'll take Moonstones, I guess. I don't really care for Moonstones. If I see a skin I like, I'm gonna buy it. You know, but whatever. I'll take the Moonstones. Look at this quest, guys, right here. This one's so funny. Kill 12 Saltwater Crocodile. I was joking around with my fam. I was telling them, like, look, they, they put a uh, daily quest in my weekly... In my weekly quest, <laughs> you know, usually it's something ridiculous like kill like 45 salt qua, you know, or like, you know, something like insane, you know, like kill 100. Like last week, I had like kill 140 cobras, you know, it's annoying, right? But this one was easy, so I'm glad I got an easy quest. I need to kill 890 animals in Savannah Valley, uh, which I currently have 89. So with this boost right here, we're gonna try to do this in one stream. Hopefully I could do it. I'm sure I could do it. You know, it shouldn't be too hard, but we'll see. You know, um, deal 400, 4 million damage. As you guys can see, I've been whooping because I'm already, I already dealt 30 million. I just need to dealt 12 more. <laughs> 68 champion. That's going to take me all week, but you know what? I'm, I'm a, I'm a sixth of the way there, you know, 370 animals, level 88. Ugh. I hate that. I hate Mammoth Creek, man. I do, man. 
Like these weekly quests are killing me, bro. I don't want to be in Legend Mountain. I don't want to be in Green Hills. I do not want to be in these other small rooms. I'm wasting my time. You know, I'd much rather for 30 gems, for 30 gems, I must ra rather kill 370 animals in Savannah Valley or Tropical Forest and actually get, you know, coins than to kill, you know, Mammoth Creek animals. Garbage. Ziva, what's up, man? Welcome to the stream. Log in for three days. Take part in hunting challenge. This one here, spend four million coins. I'm not gonna be able to do it, man. I'm already at my limit. I'm not gonna be able to do it, man. It's okay though. And then I got these extra ones right here, which as you can see, a lot of them are repetitive, you know, like get four million points, get 500 points. Like it's gonna be easy, man. It's gonna be easy. So that's cool, man. Complete 12 daily quests. So yeah, this week's gonna be pretty easy, man. Uh, but yeah, before I get started, I'm gonna show you guys um, some artwork that Shadow sent me. So shout out to Shadow. Shadow's always sending me artwork, and it's always awesome, right? So this time here, I'm gonna show you guys. I love it. The Thunder Wolf. I don't know if I showed it before, but I'm gonna show it again because it's such a nice drawing, man. If you guys, if you guys like. Um, if you guys want to send me some artwork, make sure you send it to my Instagram. The link is below in the description. Also, if this is your first time on the stream, welcome. If you've been here before but you have not yet done so, please make sure you like, subscribe, leave a comment. I would super appreciate it. But yeah, guys. So we finna hunt. We finna... So thank you again, Shadow. So we're gonna go and hunt 800 animals, guys. In Savannah Valley and while I do that I'm gonna kind of tell you guys what you know it's been a week since the update came out so I'm just kind of gonna go into details and tell you guys what I think about the updates and everything you know so first of all I gotta clarify overall overall I love the update right like I love any update anything that is an improvement to the game I love it right I do um you know, I think that, you know, I don't play a lot of games. Um, I don't, it, like, especially mobile games. Like, here's the thing, like, so, like, mobile games, you know, originally, here's the thing about mobile games, man. A lot of the mobile games are made by, you know, like, developers who, so, like, for example, like, Nintendo, right? You know, they have the Nintendo Switch, right? Or they have they have a lot of handheld devices, you know? But they will never ever fully go just mobile only, right? And the reason why is they make money. They make money from sell selling consoles, right? Not only that, then they can sell the titles, right? You would think, oh man, they, you know, Nintendo, uh, you know, if they made like a, you know, um... A Nintendo or something like they're gonna you know they might as well go mobile or something oh man this is gonna be so annoying if this notification keeps popping up I'm gonna be mad but anyways um so a lot of the games on the play stores man they're kind of whack you know you play any game on the play store they're kind of wet you know a lot of the games are turn-based games you know there's not a lot of RPGs you know things like that you know and what I like about I, I mean to be honest I don't play a lot of games but I think that this is the best game on the mobile store right I mean some people like first person shooters and I guess you know those are technically better right first person shooters right but you know in this game like you make progress you save your progress you know and you know you're you, you improve your character you know this is more of an RPG uh, you know the graphics for mobile they're excellent right they're excellent in my opinion, you know, and um, and I love that they keep updating it, you know, a lot of games, they just make a game and then, you know, they'll even make you pay for the game and then they just kind of drop it, you know, I like that this game always has multiple updates per year and I've been playing this game since, to be honest, I forgot, I never really kept track, I want to say it's between 2018 and 2019 is when I started playing. You know, when I started playing, they, the biggest map was Legend Mountain. 
when I started playing, um, level 50 was the max. When I started play playing, traps were already there, right? Um, you know, so... I don't know how old of a player I am, but, you know... Here's the thing, guys, so... Yeah, so... You know, maybe I don't play a lot of mobile games, but I like that they update this game a lot. Um, so, you know, shout out to them for that. That's a huge win, right? Um, but here are some things. But here's the thing about the update at the end of the day, right? And, you know, I gotta be brutally honest, you know, and I hate that I have to do this and sit this way, you know, because I do love updates, but man, to be honest, this update was very disappointing for me. Very disappointing. Like, I understand they're trying to roll out new things, they're trying to keep the game alive and things like that, and they have to do certain things, you know? Uh, but I had a lot higher expectations for this update. I know we just got a new map, right? We just got Savannah Valley earlier this year. So, you know, I really can't complain, you know? But, you know, like, here's the thing, guys. All right. I've been complaining about this PvP lag for, I don't know, for a couple months. And I hate that people always try to downplay what I'm saying. Like, they're, t they're saying that it's my device. It's not my device, guys. I played PvP for so long, I know what is lag and I know what is not, you know? I know... I'm not stupid. I know if it's my phone or I know if it's... If my phone is lagging, if my phone is having issues, the, s the frames are gonna skip on my phone, you know? Like, my phone's gonna be, like, t twitching, you know? And that when I say that there's PvP lag, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about that wolves don't die right away. I'm talking about that when you port, you know, there are still dead bodies, you know, still image of dead bodies, you know, like, there's just a lot of garbage, you know, and it's all these people who don't play PvP telling me that it, trying to tell me what is wrong, you know, like, dude, I've been playing PvP. I have the most PvPs in the server, I'm one, I probably have, I'm probably top 20 in the game with PvP kills you know and just let me just kind of show you guys because i'm super proud of this number i currently have 330,000 pvp kills oh by the way guys um that that uh that account that had a million and 300 of pvp kills is banned just so you guys know um here let me show you guys so if we go to 36r right oops How'd you do it? 36? Yeah, I'm gonna just do 36. I forgot what it, what the pack's called. Okay, let me show you guys though. Uh, let's see. So we're gonna go to rankings. We're gonna go to packs. They're probably here some. Yeah, 36 nine R's, right? Look, so this person named Cornelia, right? Has a hundred, uh, has a million killed enemies, bro. A million killed enemies, right? Their CP is currently 230,000, right? I mean, 100, 230 million, right? This is how you know this person is banned. So when you go to the global rankings, so you go to players, make sure you go to global, and then you look for 250, right? Because that's where they're at. She should be right here, between here, and she's not. So that's how you know this person got banned. So, anyways, top 20, top 20 in PvP kills, maybe even top 10 in PvP kills. I've been going through the rankings just to see who has the most, and yeah, man, I'm one of the top. Uh, I mean, so far that I've seen, you know, I haven't gone through everybody, you know, and I definitely haven't gone through the small accounts. I don't know how many small accounts PvP kills they got, you know. But uh, anyways, with that being said, you know, like when I talk about PvP, dude, I know what I'm talking about. It's not, it's something new, right? It's not like, I know when it started happening, everybody knows it started happening. And everybody who PvPs knows what I'm talking about. But anyways, I'm kind of upset that like, you know, that... The developers don't feel that it's important to fix. You know, imagine if like Call of Duty or PUBG had that kind of lag, right? You're over here sniping someone, you shoot them, and then they don't die. And then like, they kill you, and then they die. You know, like, what? You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, there is other games that have, you know, like Battle Arena games with 100 players in the server. You know, bigger maps that don't have that kind of lag, right? So it's just like, come on, man. So that's one thing why I'm disappointed about the update, right? Because uh, they haven't fixed it. I mean, hopefully they're still working on it. 
I don't know if they think that the improvements that they've made fixed it because it did not. Um, what else is new? Weekly weekly bounties, man. I think it's cool. I mean, I think it's cool. It just, I think it's cool. I ain't even gonna say nothing bad about it. You know, like weekly bounty quest. I think it's cool. It adds more fun to the game. It adds more things to do in the game. You know. Um, matter of fact, let me show you guys. Last week. We hit 5th tier, and we got 11,000 pack score, which is like the most we've ever gotten, you know. Uh, we're definitely never gonna get, unless we get more members, we're probably never gonna reach 6th uh, tier. But it's alright, man. It's alright. Uh, to be honest, the people who do top, who the top 3, you know, they get they get the, a good amount. And then, you know, the... Oh, snap. I didn't even read this, the chats, by the way, guys. So I'm gonna say, what's up, Raisin? Welcome to the stream, man. Zeus YouTube, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Lana, welcome to the stream. Majesty, welcome to the stream. Zeus said, what's your name, your pack? So my name is the God, right? But I just call, but I just, I've been changing my name around lately because you know what? Here's the thing, guys. Um, you know, like, I changed my name to a triangle, right? And they say, why do you change your name to a triangle? Because you know why? Because I'm an icon. Literally. <laughs> you know, I mean, I'm, it's like a pun, right? You know, I'm an icon in the game, and the the triangle is my icon, you know what I'm saying? And even no matter what, I, I could change my HP, I could change my name, I could change my pack, I could change my skin. People will still recognize me in the game because the way I play... And the thing, you know, and the things that I have accomplished as far as like my stats and things like that, you know. So people already know me and stuff. Uh, but yeah, so lately I've just been messing around with this name, the goat. You know, <laughs> maybe about two years back, right? Bloody Hacker and me, we had a little bit of drama, right? Back when he used to have an account that was fit to fight against me, right? <laughs> he uh. He, he used to get mad and he used to call me the goat. He thought he was insulting me. And this is this is funny and this is why I know um, Bloody Hacker isn't really into pop culture, I guess you, that is what I would call it. But it's like the goat, man. The goat means greatest of all times. It means, you know, Michael Jordan's the goat. Michael Jackson's the goat. You know, Muhammad Ali is the goat. You know, everybody... Everybody who is the greatest of all time, they call him the GOAT. And he used to call me the GOAT. And it was just so funny because it's like, dude, you have no idea that your insult is so backfiring. <laughs> You're calling me the best. <laughs> you know, but it's cool, man. Uh, so I was like, you know what? And then what's nice too about the GOAT is I could still put my little icon, my little triangle there. So I'm like, you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put the GOAT right here. Just flaunt it, you know? And yeah. That's why I changed my name to the GOAT. But I'm still the God, I'm still HTG, you know. It's, this is just a temporary nickname, just for me to mess around, you know. Everybody still, I joined PvP and everybody still calls me Triangle Man. I don't know why people call me Triangle Man, like they think that, I don't know, I guess I made a name for myself when I was just a Triangle. <laughs> it's cool, man. Uh, but anyways, uh, yeah, Weekly Brownies, I mean, they're cool. I like weekly bounties, they're not bad, you know. Um, let's see what else did they update. Private service? Nah. It's okay. I'm never gonna use it. I mean, actually I am gonna use it, but that's just because I'm a content creator. Um, I'm actually gonna do a race, guys, in Savannah Valley PvP. I'm gonna create a PvP room in Savannah Valley, and we're gonna do a race, right? You know, it's really nice because it has like a ring, you know, to go all around and stuff, the map. So it should be easy pretty easy and straightforward you know but um but yeah man that's what we're gonna uh we're gonna do that like soon i just gotta get a couple people together you know uh so i'm gonna use the private server for that i'm definitely gonna use the private server for a tournament that i'm gonna hold however here's the thing guys i don't want to hold a tournament if it has if the pvp lag still around um uh, me and the gds we did a, a fam war just recently, right? And the room was so laggy, man. So laggy. Like, you guys have... Like, it was laggy, I mean. You know, and I don't want to hold a tournament 
and have the lag going on, you know? Because it's just like, it's not fair. You know? And then if I do, but if I do, maybe it's finally gonna get fixed, right? It's finally gonna get brought up to the attention of the developers. Here's the thing, guys. Like, a lot of people think that when I'm talking about PvP lag, you just go in PvP and it starts lagging. No, that's not how it works, man. You gotta actually be doing something, man. You gotta be using skills. You gotta be pouring. You gotta be fighting other people. They gotta be using rage or speed boost. Like, I don't know, man. A lot of, I don't know. I shouldn't even have to explain myself, to be honest. But it's okay. Let's see what else they what else is updated on the map on the map. Uh premium. Oh yeah, premium man. Uh, how do I feel about premium? Let's see. Well, to be honest, I mean me. I don't mind spending ten dollars a month. I don't. I do think I do think that it's kind of crappy to do that to the players, you know. But at the same time, you know, they need money, right? They need money. Uh, there is a free option, guys. So here. So when you go to premium, if you guys don't want to spend $10 to get the premium, you can always get the silver for free, guys. You know, the silver option is still available. And you, you know, so I mean, at least they give you a silver option in case you don't want to spend money. I've seen so many people cry about that and complain about that, you know? Knowing Rage Quit though, they be, they be simping for people, like they be folding a lot. Like to be honest, you guys gotta be tougher, man. If people complain about something or cry about something, man, you know, just don't worry about it, man. I wouldn't worry about it too much. Like you know, that's the way you want it set up, that's the way it's gonna be set up, you know? Um, I've seen too, I've seen it too many times where rage quit will like conform to like what players want you know like if vs was glitched if vs was glitched man i would have told him straight up i would have told him straight up like dude it's a glitch man you know and that's it man stop crying about it end of story and that's it you know but it's all right man you know like these guys barely spent a hundred dollars to max the skill and they're crying that vs doesn't work oh i spent all this money yeah okay you gonna spend no money, what you talking about? You know, but it's okay, man. That's why Rage Quit needs to hire me, man. Because, well, first of all, I mean, I don't even want to be hired, to be honest. I don't want to be part of a Rage Quit game, but they need to partner with me, man. Because, like, to be honest, man, like, they need somebody to just be playing the game and give them feedback, you know? They need somebody who, like, I feel like the developers don't play a game. They're not vested in the game. And if they are, you know, then they're not prior prioritizing the things that need to be prioritized. You know? Uh, Black Oro Champ, left side of the tunnel. What is the left side? This is the left side? It is the left side. Guys, I'm dyslexic when it comes to directions. I forgot who said that, Mandy, but yeah, I'm definitely dyslexic when it comes to directions. I'm finna get 40 gems, guys. I'm boosted. And I'm ready to use ES. It's about to be a wrap. Look at these Oros. I love champs, man. Look at that. That's a daddy and a mommy. Alright, guys. Y'all ready or what? Ain't nobody else coming. Well, oh, there's one person coming. And he's going slow. See, I hate waiting for people, bro. That's why I don't share, man. Tweaking. Like, but it's okay. I didn't find a champ anyway, so. I guess I'll wait. Look at that. Alpha's not even here. All right, guys. Let's just start this. Danger, that was so mean, HTG. You just killed that thing in two shots. <laughs> it wasn't me. 
That was bogus, right? <laughs> but anyways... No share now. Terry said no share now. Oh no. What am I gonna do now? My bad. Y'all... I told you guys this... That's how I roll, man. You guys were using skills anyways, not my fault you're too slow. <laughs> Alright, anyways, yeah, so Rage Clay, you guys need to partner with me and just literally tell, like, just, you know, I play 80 hours a week on your game, man. And I don't need to get paid by you guys or be hired by you guys. I just need, like, to be honest, there's a lot of feedback I want to give you guys, you know, and, you know, there's, there's things that, um, I don't know, man. But anyways, work's going great. I love, I love where I work, guys. All day, I'm in and out of PvP rooms, killing people. Because that's how chill my job is, man. I could literally just, I go to work, I play for like 30 minutes, help a customer, take a break, play for another 30 minutes, help a customer. People think that like, I don't do anything all day. Cause I mean, I do, but I don't, right? But, you know, I love, I love my job, guys, you know, and maybe I'm not rich, right? Like some of y'all, because I don't know how you, some of y'all be so rich, wasting so much money on a game. Like, y'all don't got bills or something, <laughs> you know, but I don't know how some of y'all be having so much money, you know, like, and it's like I can't I can't justify spending that much money like the most that I've ever spent at once on the game was probably like two hundred dollars and two hundred dollars doesn't get you a whole lot of anything bro you know like max level ES is thirty nine thousand gems you know what I'm saying like that's not even two hundred dollars. Two hundred dollars barely gets you like twenty eight thousand gems, you know, or whatever it is. So it's just like, how do you guys get so much money and still pay your bills? <laughs> I mean, I feel like I make a lot of money, to be honest. And I, uh, and I can't justify spending that much money, man. I'd be thinking to myself, like, man, I could buy some jewelry, I could buy some groceries, I could customize my car. You know, I've been wanting to get tinted windows on my car. I I've been getting tinted. <laughs> I haven't been getting tinted windows on my car, cause uh I I've been um I don't like getting pulled over, guys. Five O be tripping, bro. Police out here always tripping, man. They always want you here. They be violating your rights like crazy, man. They always make you want to step out of the car, cause of your history, cause cause of my. This is my record, you know. Every time they pull me over, you know, I got gang affiliation records, I got drug records, I got other records, you know, like um, criminal records and stuff like that. So like every time I get pulled over, they always be harassing me, bro. Searching my car without my permission, searching me, questioning me about things that are relevant now. You know, like I got gang records from like seven years ago. You know what I'm saying, like. I'm not into that stuff no more, you know. I still have, I still hang with the same people, but like, we don't go out, we don't go out doing the things we used to do, you know. We grown folks now, but that stuff follows you around, man. <laughs> but anyways, so I try not to customize my car too much because if I do, it attracts the wrong attention, and then you automatically get stereotyped as like a criminal or as ghetto or something and then you just that's how it is out here and being a minority in Chicago you know I don't know how it is in other states or other countries but out here you're a minority in Chicago man and I'm not even a super minority you know but yeah Martin what's up man welcome to the stream I'm working on my weekly quest right now this is my current weekly quest I gotta kill 800 animals. I'm at 300, which is decent to be honest because I haven't even been paying attention. But yeah. I was just kind of going over the update 
Um, and then I spoke to Blue about the update, like, and I guess there's this is like part one of like of a big update, you know. They're eventually gonna do the things that I mentioned before, you know, when I predicted what was gonna happen in the update. But um, you know, it's not gonna roll out just yet. So it's cool though. I mean, I'll take it again. Like I said, I mean, overall, you know, I'm just happy that they do update the game and that they care about the game. You know, it'd be it'd be so bad if the game. Imagine if they treated the game like the tiger, bro. <laughs> Everybody still wants me to play the tiger, and I want to play the tiger too because I feel like there's not that many streamers of the tigers. You know, the tiger community they don't have the same uh, point of view about me as the wolf community, right? So they love me, they watch my videos, they love it, and they all want me to play the game. But man, I just I can't play the game, guys. It's just terrible for me. Like I don't know. I just feel like it's it's neglected. <laughs> you know, the Cheeto is probably even worse. You know, I've seen the I've seen the skins, the Moonstone skills for 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 the tiger. Matter of fact, I'm probably gonna play the tiger tonight just so I could poke fun at it. <laughs> I've seen the skins for the tiger. They cost like two thousand Moonstones, bro. And the skins look like the free skins, bro. They don't even look like gl they're not glowing skins or anything. <laughs> they're garbage. <laughs> but they want 2,000 moonstones for them. And I was like, oh my god, dude. That is terrible. I don't know what they're doing in that game, you know? It's like they have, like, nobody working on it. But surprisingly, they got a lot of players, man. I told them already, bro. Just... And it, it's impossible to do, right? They said it's impossible to do, but... Um, I, I would think it'd be cool if they made a crossplay between the tiger and the wolf. Just combine everything, combine all the maps, combine all the players. Obviously, get rid of all the hackers, right? Cause the tiger, man. Oh my god, the tiger is just full of hackers, bro. I feel like that's why maybe they neglect the game is because there's way too many hacked accounts that they don't want to ban because they've been around for too long, you know. But yeah, man, just. I think it'd be cool if you could crossplay the tiger versus the wolf. Like, say you join a PvP room and it's mixed with tigers and wolves, and you just fight. You know, that'd be cool. You know, obviously they'd have to bring the tiger up to date, right? Like they'd have to bring level 90. They'd have to add some totems. You know, the but that'd be cool, man. I mean, they can do it. Like technically, Evil Lands has different class, right? Evil Lands is their other games, right? You could play, you know, a warrior. You could play an assassin. You could play a mage, right? You know, that should be the same thing. The wolf should just be called, you know, they should have three classes. The cheetah, the tiger, and the wolf, you know? All have different skill sets. All, but you can cross play together, bro. Use all the maps. Use all the same maps. Use all the same um, PvP rooms and just play together man that would be awesome bro just combine it that way then you just have to do one update you ain't even gotta do three updates for three different games you know but obviously i'm not the de developer so it's probably more complex it's probably impossible for them to do but i think that would be dope man but i'm gonna play the tiger tonight just so then we could laugh at it <laughs> We could laugh at it and feel sorry for those who still play the game and spent a lot of money on it. I spent a lot of money on Tiger Man. I probably spent like three, four hundred dollars on it, bro, dude. Because I thought they was gonna come back. I thought they were gonna make a comeback, but nah, they didn't make a comeback. They forgot about it again. Yo, Saber, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Saber, say rip, innocent cheetah. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't innocent. It was a champion, so that automatically makes it a... That automatically makes it a, a target for me. Martin said, You have all week for these, no rush. I do have all week for these, man. And you know what? What I love about the weekly quests is that they're all working simultaneously. So like right now, this quest here goes hand in hand with this quest, goes hand in hand with this quest, and this quest, and this quest, and this quest. You know what I mean? Like, 
I'm literally completing like four or five quests at a time, you know, doing when I'm only focusing on one. So I love it. Um, Martin said, I have an account the Tiger only to claim pack names. Someone wants to run the pack, log on every now and then, can't get used to it. Combine packs with cats and dogs. <laughs> I mean, I still think that the Tigers packs and the wolf pack should be separate, because in real life that wouldn't make sense. I don't know. Again, I mean, that idea is just something stupid that is never going to happen, but I think it'd be cool. I remember one time I made that suggestion, everybody was so mad. Like, here's what I don't understand, like, if you don't like something, bro, you don't have to hate on it, you know, just be quiet, just don't say nothing. With me, when it comes to me, bro, when it comes to me, everybody always gotta, like, go against me. This is terrible, bro. Look, this is what happened, guys. I joined a co-op room, right? Random co-op room. And Mandy just says, hey, welcome, ACD, right? I'm like, hey, what's up, you know? And she's like, yo, so what's up? What you think about the update? And I, you know, I told her straight up, you know, I'm kind of disappointed because PvP lag wasn't fixed. And I was hoping that that was going to be, that was the only thing that I wanted them to fix. You know, I don't really care about all this other stuff, but I really wanted PvP lag to be fixed. And, you know, I don't know where this person, you know, you know, this was an A and B conversation and C pops up out of nowhere. And she like, she's like, well, it's obviously your phone because I don't have any issues. And then she's like, oh, and by the way, I don't think you're special like everyone else does. And it's just like, okay, first of all, I wasn't talking to you. Second of all, like, I never said I was special. But you stating that and you, you know, feeling the need to comment negatively on my, on my conversation with someone else, you know, it's like, you make me feel special, you know? I don't even know you. It was some chick named Jess. She was level 80. She, she had no PvP. She only had like 60,000 PvP. You know? She, was, she didn't she didn't know. She doesn't know how to play. She didn't know how to play, bro. But anyways. Aw, snap. I just com com completed a weekly quest. And I just got alpha. Yeah, let's see where my score is at right now. Only 600. Yeah, I'm probably not going to get a million. Martin said the topic isn't called suggestion discussion for nothing. It's okay to explain why you're against a suggestion. One could politely say though. Oh no, I agree. I agree. It's just, again, it's fine if somebody, um, that, that discussion happened by the way in, um, in co-op. But, uh, yeah, no, in a the suggestion discussion, that's fine if you guys have debate. But like, you guys don't have to, I don't know, like, if I say something like, hey, can you fix the PvP lag? You don't have to say, are you a developer? Do you make games? Like, no, bro, just let me voice my opinion. You know, it's okay. You know, like, you don't have to defend them. Let, you know, like, just move on. You know, make your own suggestions. I don't care when you guys say you guys want rainbow wings with, you know, whatever, you know. I don't care about that. I think it's whack. I don't want my wolf to look like a freaking, you know, with wings and, you know, all sorts of colors, you know, but I'm not going around saying, oh, no, that's nasty, that's ugly, you know, like, let, let everybody have their own opinion, you know, and if you are against it, you know, stick to the topic, don't go and start saying, oh, yeah, HGG, we don't like you, oh, yeah, you're rude, this and that, and this and that, like, bro, stop it, man, and then, and then half of the people on Discord, you know, they're friends with the, the moderators, the moderators are very biased, you know, they'll put you, they'll put you on slow mode, but then they won't put the other person who are their friends on slow mode, right? Even though the argument is between the two people, right? Again, man, I gave up on trying to justify, everybody knows it, man, that's why, that's why, that's why there's like 50,000 members in the Discord, bro. And the only people who are active are the same 10 people, bro. You know, and then whenever they do something or say something, you know, they just, they can't, we can't stand up for ourselves. Because then you get shut down, you know. All the main players, guys. All the main players, top 10 players, they're never on Discord, bro. Because even though I feel like top 10 players, 
opinions should be more should be more um oh look there's a there's a rhino champion let's go get it snoopy you idiots it's my quest okay we finna go get the rhino champ take their gems 40 gems taken from them what you eat all right we finna go and eat this rhino I'm a port though, even though I know I'm gonna kill it in like two shots. Real said no more share. Oh look, they're already attacking it. Okay, well, in this case. Thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna say thank you just to rub it in their face. <laughs> I love Boost that. Boost is just like You guys saw how I killed that rhino like nothing. Look man, if I show up somewhere and you guys are already attacking it and killing it, I'm not gonna port and share with other people who already said no more share quote unquote, right? You know what I'm saying? I was gonna port if I seen everybody chill, but they weren't. They were all attacking it, so I just came in there, you know, bada beam, bada boom, wham bam, thank you, ma'am, and hopped out. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> Anyways, five more minutes, and then I'm done with the stream. But anyways, uh, yeah. Here's what I think that we need to do on Discord. I think we should have only moderators who are not players. That would be cool. Because then it's like, not a bias thing, you know? Like, you know, everybody's just so like, it's bad, dude. You know, like, um, by the way, guys, you guys know that CM Pack, CMP Pack is trying to bully me? They're trying to bully me? So here's the thing, right? So CM Pack is probably the most toxic pet. Like, you guys don't know this, and I'm sure it's blue doesn't notice, but they are the most toxic people. CM Pack is behind all these toxic wolf pages. I'm telling you guys, they're behind all these wolf newsletters. And you know, and here's the thing: CM Pack doesn't follow me, right? On Instagram, I have 1,400 followers on Instagram, right? And they don't follow me, which is okay, right? But then there's this meme page of me on Instagram, right? With only like 30 followers. And it's literally all CM Pack. That's how I know they're behind it. Because it's literally all CM Pack following it. And it's like, and none of them even follow me. So I know it's one of them who made it to bully me. Because I'm always talking trash to them on Discord. And they're too scared to come out, you know. To come out and do it. So they hide behind these fake Instagram accounts and cyber bully people. But to be honest, I don't really care. Martin say which newsletter. I mean, there's a lot of them, you know, but... The Toxic Wolf player, that one is definitely behind a CM Pack member. I already know. Just the way they are, just the way, just the way that CM Pack comes in that page. You know, like, there's only certain people who support that page, like that page, comment on that page, and say things. And it's always the CM Pack people. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but anyways, man. I wish I could probably start something, like some kind of petition where it's like, you know what? In the Discord, man, I know. They work for free and what yada 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 right it's blue you know it's smart because he ain't gotta pay nobody to do <laughs> his job like it's blue look shout out to you man i don't i know it sounds wrong i know it, does, it sounds like weird but and it sounds like but at the end of the day bro they're doing your job for free <laughs> you smart bro you smart see it's blue is a it's blue is a pimp bro he got he got little he got his little uh, workers, his minions, doing his job for free. But in my opinion, bro, they need somebody who doesn't play a game, somebody who has a non-bias to, like, moderate, you know, like, arbitrary, like, you can't have it's conflict of interest, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's okay, I mean, they try, though, at the end of the day, they try to be fair, but they're not. <laughs> And, um, you know, and they talking about, oh yeah, we're gonna ban you on Discord and this and that, you know, like, I have, the only use that I have for Discord 
It's so then I'm up to date with the updates. I don't read none of the chats. I don't submit suggestions. I stopped doing it because it's just like, dude, they're just so petty with everything, bro. Like, they just want to flex their power, dude. If I was a moderator, I'd be the chillest moderator ever, bro. If they wrote something inappropriate or something like that, I would just delete it and just say, don't do it again, you know? If, uh, if somebody made a wrong suggestion, man, I would just leave it. You know, like, oh yeah, you forgot to put your device, you forgot to do this and that. I would read the reason of their, you know, like, say there's a bug, right? You know, say there's a bug, right? Like, say I say that, um, you know, PvP is laggy, like, entire PvP is laggy. I don't need, I wouldn't need for them to put their type of device or do anything like that. I know the developers want it like that, but it's just a general. It's a general, it doesn't matter, it applies to all, man. You know, I would put all the time, every device. Martin said you should read my high quality post there. Well, here's the thing, guys. <laughs> I'm not trying to use my platform to promote their accounts and their cyberbullying. You know, like I don't want, like a lot of it's very toxic. A lot of it is false information. You know, and it's very biased, you know, there's a lot of toxic, like, there's a page called Toxic Wolf Players. I run into them every day, but it's always the ones that they want to attack that they, you know, like, if you're gonna expose Toxic Wolf Players, expose them all, right? Expose them all, you know, don't just focus on three of them and make a page supposedly to expose Toxic Wolf Players when really you're just trying to bully three people, you know? That's all. But, um, that community is pretty messed up. Uh, and to be honest, that's why I don't care. And I'm, you know, and I try to be savage about it and just speak my mind, man. What are they gonna do? Delete my wolf account? Nowhere in the terms and services does it say that out of the game I need to be respectful or need to do anything like that, bro. I will diss them every, in a heartbeat every single day if they come at me, man. You know, a lot of people don't understand, you know, like these wolf players, the, these, uh, this community toxic wolf player, uh, profiles, man, they're, they're the ones bullying you. They're the ones making posts about you, hiding their face. You know, first of all, whenever I have something bad to say, I say it on my platform. I say it saying that it's me, you know, I don't need to make a new profile and just, you know, pretend that I'm not who I am just to formulate my opinion you know I said straight up you know but these people know they're doing something wrong and that's why they won't use their name you know and they're just doing it to bully certain people so have a good day Martin let's see oh my boost right now so let's see where are we at right now um so I have only 800,000 score Let's see, I need, dang, I only got 500 animals. Look at all these. I'm waiting to claim these until I, uh, I'm waiting to claim these until the bounty is done. Um, I mean, bounty is ready. I don't know why it takes so long for it to reset, man. Like, really? It's called weekly bounty, but you only give us five days to do it. Bogus. Now, you guys just started at Monday in the morning, bro. You know? We would probably reach, like me and my pack would probably reach tier 6 if you guys gave us the whole week to do it, but you don't. Garbage. That's gonna be no suggestion. I don't wanna leave a suggestion because then everybody's gonna cry. Say, you know, try to simp for uh, Rage Quit Games, but that is a good suggestion. Start the weekly bounty in the beginning of the week. You know, why are you gonna have a weekly bounty? You should call it 5 day bounty. <laughs> but yeah guys anyways thank you all for tuning in man sorry about my rant i always be ranting i always be talking about stuff you know but because to be honest guys i hold a back a lot especially on discord man i want to talk so much trash you guys have no idea how toxic and how 
how I how opinionated and how much I want to voice my opinion. But you can't. So I try to be respectful and say things very um and say things very neutral. And somehow I still get banned or like literally you can't have an argument with CM Peck. You can't. You are you go against anything they say, they're gonna put you on slow mode, they're gonna mute you, they're gonna tell you, dude, just stop it. End of the conversation. Karen's bro, they're all Karen's. Suggestion number one, race quick game is hire some non-community players for to moderate the community. Rule number suggestion number two, make the five-day bounty into an actual week bounty, man. Anyways, have a great night, guys. Take care. Lana, thank you for stopping in. Fam, thank you for stopping in here. Actually, I'm going to answer your question. You said, what recommend skills basic and special to a newbie to? Um, so here's what I recommend. I recommend you get lifesteal, and I recommend you get freezing breath. Start with those moves. Those moves will get you a long way in co-op. Once you have those moves, um, once you get stronger... Then get double claw because right now, if you get double claw, it's not going to be strong enough to do anything. Um, so I would say start with life steel, start with um, freezing breath, and then once you get strong enough, then you can do um, definitely get traps. Once you get strong enough, then you can get d double claw and you can get electro shock for PvP. Here, so literally, this is the skills that I recommend for a newbie. Lifesteal or VOC. Um, damage boost. Damage boost is mandatory. Don't focus on anything but damage boost. Or rage if you want rage, but damage boost is like the earliest skill that you could get. And it makes such a difference. Freezing breath and then traps. I recommend you start off with poison traps. And then for PvP, once you get strong enough to fight in PvP, these are the skills that I recommend. Double claw. Um damage boost electroshock all right well thank you for tuning in saber thank you for stopping by abijula what's up man i didn't even see you here man thank you for coming martin thank you for coming zeus thank you for coming raisin thank you for coming ziva thank you for coming aku thank you for coming anyways have a great day guys i'm gonna stream the tiger tonight we're gonna make fun of it all right so make sure you guys are there take care